Dirty Monkey Smell Bad is an acronym for the steps involved in long division. Divide, multiply, subtract, bring down. While it's true that monkeys who are dirty may smell bad, Dirty Monkey's Smell Bad is also a mnemonic for remembering the steps involved in completing long division problems. This is the story of one primate, Monkey, helping his classmate with a math problem. Along the way, the struggling monkey learns the importance of hygiene. A vocabulary in context activity follows the text. One thousand eight hundred divided by twenty two. What do I do? What do I do? Dirty monkey smell bad, said a voice offering a strange clue. A puzzled look made the voice repeat, Dirty monkey smell bad, nothing new. The voice went on, my friend, seeing my numbness, I listened, intent on disguising my dumbness. D for dirty also stands for divide, this time not as easy perhaps as others you've tried. 10 divided by 2 is 5, you know. You memorized 5 times 2 long ago. You know 72 divided by 8 easy as pi. The answer must be 9 because the opposite of division is to multiply. Times tables in the thousands no one remembers. Can't do it by June or six more Septembers. Dirty monkey smell bad was his reply. Continuing to listen, I let out a sigh. You know your times tables? Nodding, I responded proud of at least that I was able. And since you know five times two is 10, you must also know 10 divided by two. I needn't go over that again. The answer is five, five of course. But from this, how do we arrive at the answer to my problem? I fear I'm growing hoarse. Dirty monkeys smell bad, let me finish. D for dirty also stands for divide. In division, there are basic rules by which we must abide. At that, he took out a clothespin and attached it to his nose, apparently to illustrate that without my morning shower, I didn't smell like a rose. Guided to the sink and to the soap, continuing to listen, for help with division was my only hope. Let's look at this 22, he said. We must divide it into 1,808. Use your head. Washing and thinking, I was at a loss. Didn't know which, the soap or the math, I wanted to toss. Take it step by step, he suggested. By the end of the week, we're going to be tested. Look at that 22. Could it fit into the 1 or the 18? You know it can't as well as I do. Try the 180 now. How many times can 22 fit into 180? How many will it allow? 7 perhaps? Try it and see. In division, scrap paper is mandatory. Nope, not 7. 9 perhaps? It can't be 11. Nope, 9's too big. Eight seems logical. Long division is truly diabolical. The D is done. What next for dirty monkeys smell bad, I said. M for multiply, of course. M for monkey and multiply. He handed me a towel with which to dry. Eight times two is 16. Eight times two is 16 plus one is 17. What's next? Enough of dirty monkeys I have seen. He removed the clothespin, happy to see a once dirty monkey now clean. S stands for subtract as well as smell. Remember these steps and in division you'll do well. Subtract I did and when I was through, I asked what's next? What's next to do? 
B stands for bad as well as bring down. If the problem's not done, you must again go around. Eight is the number brought down. The problem's not done. How long to go around? How many times can 22 fit into 48? Let's finish up. Not much longer now to wait. Maybe two? Let's see. As I told you, in division, scrap paper is mandatory. Two is certainly enough. Trying to fit 22 in a third time would certainly be rough. M for monkey also stands for... That's great. Thanks for giving it a try. Two times two is... Two times two is... Great. What more? S for smell also stands for... 48 minus 44 is 4, and that's a fact. There's nothing left but a remainder of 4. The way we did this problem made it fun, not a bore. Now, with clean monkey armpits, fingers, and toes, clean monkey ears, face, and nose, a clean monkey body, and clean monkey clothes, make everyone happy and glad, because everyone knows Dirty monkeys smell bad. Glossary. You understood these words in context. Go back and see if you can come up with your own definition of each. Then check the dictionary to see if you are right. Disguising, horse, abide, illustrate, logical, diabolical, bore, apparently, mandatory. I sincerely hope you enjoyed using this educational tool as much as I enjoyed writing it. If you did, I would greatly appreciate a short review on Amazon or your favorite book or instructional materials website. Reviews are crucial for letting others know of the value of any instructional resource, and even just a line or two can make a huge difference.